Every summer, thousands from all over the world come up to the Northwoods to immerse themselves in a world with so much to offer. This past weekend proved cultural differences are no barrier, and our Brenda Mack has more on this year's International Day. This is how the world should be. Like, everybody get together, everybody learning from each other, and everybody's like one big family. No matter where you're from. I'm from Senegal. Perfect. I'm yeah. from Cote d'Ivoire. Oh, I'm from China. Many can always call this place home. I love it here. It's my second home. Here at Concordia Language Villages, language is no barrier. You're learning without even knowing it. And every summer, thousands of students from all over the world come together for an experience unlike any other. We have about 1,200 villagers and staff members from all across the United States, all around the world. And they're here to really share the language and culture that they have been immersed in for the last one, two or four weeks. From Swedish to Chinese to Arabic, any languages other than English became universal for many villagers. When we are together, we don't see skin color or where you're from. We see people. And of course, food is the universal language that brings cultures together. Here you can find all cuisines from German croissants behind me to Vietnamese banh mi's right here on my hand. International Day represents or brings the mission of Concordia Language Villages to life. It's about preparing young people for responsible global citizenship and you just see it happen literally before your eyes on International Day. And this is only the beginning of a lifelong journey for many. So hopefully by senior year I'll be able to study abroad, maybe in yeah. Spain and I want to do it in an Arab country like Morocco or Jordan and I think that this experience learning Arabic will help me kind of broaden my um, knowledge in the Arab, the Arab speaking world. And the theme for this year's International Day is on climate change. In Bemidji, Brenna Mack, Lincoln News. For more information on upcoming events at the Concordia Language Camp, you can always check out their website at concordialanguagevillages.org. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.